Since 2011, millions of people from the Middle East, Africa and Asia have fled to Europe, with 2015 reflecting a record spike in migration. Reasons are varied, including war, insecurity, relative deprivation, globalization and acute poverty. People want a better future for themselves, but to get there, many have put themselves at grave risk, suffering physical abuse, forced labor, trafficking and extortion. Thousands have died trying to cross into Europe. To understand the role of smugglers who facilitate this process, the Institute for Security Studies and the Global Initiative Against Transnational Organized Crime conducted interviews with 200 migrants and 150 international experts, policymakers, and national authorities. The interviews were done in countries of origin, transit, and destination along the major routes into Europe. The results provide a clear picture of Europe's refugee and migration crisis and its implications. The high volume of migrants overwhelms destination and transit countries. While some of these countries are unable, others are unwilling to meet their international obligations. People are divided over whether this mass movement presents a threat, an opportunity, or a humanitarian imperative. The impact on stability and electoral politics in Europe is profound. In August 2015, Germany's Chancellor announced a temporary measure that would allow all Syrians escaping conflict, free movement and asylum in Germany. While it reduced the risk of transiting by land across Eastern Europe, it attracted more migrants seeking asylum. Two months later, Germany changed tact and reinstated the EU Dublin regulation that requires clear documentation of all migrants. Amid this crisis, one particular group has flourished, smugglers. At least 80% of migrants rely on smugglers. Most migrants appear to have no other option than to use these smugglers. Different actors have been drawn into smuggling. It has become big business. Criminals profit from it. Smuggling fuels corruption and it finances conflict, instability and terrorism. Smuggling perpetuates and deepens the migration crisis. It is no longer just about what caused migration to Europe, but also about what keeps it going. Solving conflict alone won't reduce migration. Innovative and long-term solutions must respond to the drivers, catalysts and key actors. The ISS and its partners seek to better understand migration by continuing work on its drivers, its manifestations and the consequences for security and development.